Stop picking on him, Dunk. You're with him in the stall all day, and now you're going to start picking on him? Token was really against being Duncan's friend. He was mean, he was aggressive. He kept running away from him. But Duncan was so persistent. It's so cute, right? Oh, <laughs> Duncan would just follow him around everywhere. But one day I saw them sharing some hay together <laughs> and Token didn't fight him back. <laughs> Duncan realized he won him over and he became his buddy. He has to be friends with everyone. What's happened to you, Dunk? Oh my God. <laughs> Ever since we adopted Duncan, his personality was just huge. <laughs> He's like a barn dog. If you spray him, he will drop and roll. It's ridiculous. Well, if the wheelbarrow is too high for him, he pulls it down. all the little bits of alfalfa, it's like having candy. A mess. Also, we have some fans, his height. He will stand in front of the fan for as long as he can. Like the hair is blowing back in the wind. It's really funny to see. Honey, you're standing in front of the fan, but you're on the wrong side. He wants to be the center of attention. He will literally come in the circle of the children and their families. And there he goes. <laughs> He'll walk around, mingle with everybody, let them know he's here. Duncan. He's always the first one to try to get to know any new horses or animals that come to the farm. We have this one pony. Um, excuse me. She definitely will not share her food with anybody, but he could go in the same bucket with her and she would let him. We're sharing. We definitely think of him as our mascot. He was meant to be here. Duncan makes such a positive impact in so many lives. Oh my goodness. <laughs>